Well, Bethel Church making the announcement that they have given up on hope for a miracle and the resurrection of their daughter, Olive Heilengethel. This is the daughter of Callie and Andrew Heilengethel. Callie is a worship leader there at Bethel Church. It was just a couple of days ago where their two-year-old daughter was pronounced dead after she stopped breathing in the church, had reached out to not just the community, but the entire world asking for prayer that God would resurrect little Olive back from the dead. And look, this was criticized by a lot of people as just saying, look, you know, let her go. Uh, let her be with Jesus now. Uh, but you know what? As far as they go, as far as the family goes, uh, Callie and Andrew both saying, look, you know, we." it says in the Bible, you know, Jesus has that resurrection power. We have that same resurrection power. If he could raise people from the dead back then, who's to say he can't do it today? And he can. God can absolutely do anything. But after two days they made the announcement that they were going to go ahead and accept the fact that it looks like God was not going to perform the miracle. Guys, before I go any further, if you don't mind giving this video a like, share it across all of your platforms to help me spread the word. Subscribe here to the channel, hit the bell and notifications so you get all the new video content and support me on Patreon, patreon.com slash conservative truth, link in the description. Sign up, become a $5 or more patron today. If you guys enjoy these videos that I do and you're blessed by them, you'd like to support me by making a monthly donation, I would greatly appreciate that. We're going to be bringing exclusive content over to Patreon very soon that will not be here on YouTube. And of course, with all the YouTube censorship going on lately, I might be just completely kicked off this platform entirely. So don't wait for that to happen, guys. Get over to Patreon, sign up today. But the statement was released by Bethel Church's official Instagram page. And I will put a link to that down below in the description. You guys can read the statement in full. The family has decided that they're going to go ahead and proceed with the memorial service for Olive. They know that she is now in the presence of Christ, and they will be united with her once again. There's going to be a lot of reunions once we all get to heaven. And so they're asking for everybody's prayers at this time. Very difficult time, of course. You know, right before Christmas, this happens. Uh, and it's just uh, it's just tragic. It's uh, heartbreaking to hear something like this happen. Of course, she had a big sister, Elsie, uh, who's also missing her very much right now. But guys, what do you think? Let me know in the comment section. Do you agree with their stance on them believing for a miracle and God raising their daughter from the dead? What is your stance on that? Let me know your thoughts. Thank you so much for watching. Again, we'll be keeping the entire Bethel Church family in our prayers, and especially Callie and Andrew. I'll be back with more. You guys take care. Please be safe out there. God bless each and every single one of you, and I will talk with you soon.